What's up, y'all? It's the caveman back here again. This video is probably, you know, if people even see this, probably gonna be, you know, another crazy redneck, you know, conspiracy theory. You know, I don't give a damn about all that. There's all kinds of shit going on in the world, and people need to know about it. So if anybody sees this video, like this some bitch. We need to get our country back. And I, this video might not be that long, cause camera's dying, and yeah, I gotta get it charged up. So this video might not end up being that long. So as I'm sitting here watching, you know, what they call the alternative news, this chick decides to come out. On national, you know, on national news, and say that Donald Trump raped her thirty-five years ago. Thirty-five years, and is just now saying it. What a month. Before the election? Come on now. I mean, they're trying to attack Donald so, so much because the Clintons are just trying to cover their ass. That's all it's about. The Clintons are just trying to cover their tracks. You know, they're getting to the point where they're getting caught with everything that's happened. And they're running out of lies to tell. So, you know, Bill Clinton's settled many, many sex uh, rape cases, you know, sex scandal, you know, cases, whatever you want to call it. Had to pay out $850,000 just to one chick. That's just the one chick so she would keep her mouth shut. I mean, come on now. And Bill Clinton rides on a jet just so he can do what he does. You know, the whole rape and pedophile deal, that's on the Clintons. Hillary's worse than he is. Hillary treats women like shit. Like, com completely. So... Uh, a month before the election, this chick decides to come out and say Donald did something to her. So, you know, 35 years. Why would you wait 35 years for something like that? Something like that should be said immediately when it happens. The only reason Bill Clinton and Hillary Clinton get away with it is because they got the money for it. They pay out to it. Granted, it's not their money. Like, it's not, I mean, it's not their money. They're sucking somebody that can get that money. I mean, you don't mean to be plain, but honest with it, you know. But... There is a lot going on in this world, y'all. I'm going to pack me a lip real quick. Dipping on some Stoker's Long Cut Natural. Stoker's is some good shit. I don't know if you can see any of that back there. But I got three big ass tubs of Stoker's Long Cut Winter Green. All empty. All Stoker's can at the top. You know, Copenhagen. I love a Copenhagen Long Cut. Copenhagen Long Cut. Copenhagen Snuff. The shit. But back on top. There's a lot going on in the world right now. And Americans really need to wake up. And we need to put our foot down and say it's time to stop. Donald Trump might not be the best choice for a president. But he's better over Hillary Clinton which just sold this country out to numerous Middle East countries. 
I mean, come on now. What about, I mean, have y'all, I don't know if anybody has ever seen the video. He came, we saw, you know, he died. Those words came out of her mouth. And she said, let's move past it. Because she knew what she did. She had no way to, like, she had no way to cover it up. It happened. She paid some money. Probably got some dude off. And now she's running for president. I mean, come on, y'all. I know Americans got a little more common sense than that. A lot of it, I think, has got to do with people are scared. People are scared to know, you know, to, I mean, it's not the time to be scared, it's time to stand up. We're Americans, there's a constitution there for, the way, for a reason. We the people, we the people, not the government. They're not, I mean, they're trying to control every little, like, everything. It's time to pull your bootstraps up. It's time to be an adult. And it's time to get ready for what's going to be... Like, this next year is going to be the worst America has ever seen. Talks of war with Russia. Congressman sits there and asks four-star general, Hey... Why don't we just send our uh, drone missiles in and blow up their planes in no fly zone over Syria? Four star general sits there and says, They'll retaliate. Congressman looks at him and says, This is not going to kill nobody. It's a pilotless missile. What they're not realizing is, when they retaliate, it's going to be on the west coast. They're going to bomb the hell out of California, Oregon, Washington, freaking Idaho, Utah, Nevada, you know, Colorado, whatever state, you know, all the states that's up through there. They're going to bomb the hell out of it. That's the retaliation that, that four-star general was talking about. I mean, these are the people that... We've put in off like we, like that we've put in office as congressmen. I mean, the four-star general sat there and said that's going to start World War Three, and that's certainly not a decision I'm going to make. And I respect that man for that. A four-star general, he don't want to go to war with Russia. Nobody wants to go with war, go to war with Russia or China. I mean, how stupid can you get? China, Russia, North Korea, and the U.S. got the most nukes in the world. Iran's right there behind them. I mean, come on. Hillary Clinton and Hillary Clinton's foundation. I mean, they paid the, paid the Saudis. Saudi Arabia. I mean, that's what a lot, the downfall, a lot of the downfall in the Middle East comes from Saudi Arabia. They live like kings over there. Because of the Clintons. Because of the Bushes. I mean, can people not get this through their thick freaking skull? Man, I mean, seriously. Now give me just one second. I need to get on my job. Just plain old blue mud jug. Nothing special. Dear. But, I mean, it's time for this country to get their shit together. I seen a congressman on mainstream news. It was on C SPAN, CNN. This con congressman sitting there talking about when Hurricane Matthew was coming in said that, uh, let's see what country, I can't remember what country it was. Guam. Guam. 
off the coast of Florida, down there around where the Bahamas are. Congressman sat there and said, if we move all the people to one side, get them away from the path of the storm, that that the island out in the middle of the ocean is going to tilt and capsize. An island don't float in the middle of the ocean. That is a freaking, like, are these people stupid? Like, I might not be the brightest, you know, I might not be the brightest person in the world, but you know what? I got a little bit of common sense. And I know what twat when I look and see something, you know. These guys are idiots. This la I watched this last debate. Donald Trump murdered Hillary Clinton. Brought it all out about the lies of the 35,000, 33,000 emails that she deleted. All the shit she deleted from Benghazi. I mean, come on now. We're Americans. We're supposed to be smarter than this. But no, they got all this video games. And don't get me wrong, I like video games. I play them. But that's not my focus. My focus is work and trying to figure out a way to voice my opinion to try to help this country get a, dig itself out of, a hole, out of the hole that these politicians have dug in there for us. Like, it's ridiculous. I just think, like, if I'm going to be a part of this dip and snuff team, man, like, this is some topics that we have to talk about. Because, I mean, it's great to see that we have people of this generation that wants to help out, wants to voice their opinion, and wants to grow a little bit so their voice can be heard. We got a platform right here to do it on. I mean, come on. Let's bust them on it. You know how many people, like, just like the D, uh, DNC, head of the DNC dude that died, coincidentally, died after the, uh, leaking some stuff out about Hillary Clinton and her campaigns and the foundation, the Clinton Foundation. Come on, people. That's not a coincidence. That dude got killed because he was trying to leak out some classified information that needs to be. That actually needs to be. So, you know, I'm running pretty good time here right now. I didn't think this video would last this long. Camera's almost dead. But, I'm going to get out of here and charge this thing up. I hope some people see this, man. Dip and snuff. Watch this whole video. This is some topics that we need to be talking about. Like, we got to get these more and more. Like, let it grow. Let it get bigger. Everybody. Mine's really, really small right now. But I'm sure with a little help over here, it'll grow little help from over here everybody you know get all these channels in place get some good topics going and see each one of us grow this is something that needs to be talked about so yeah I'm gonna leave it with that this is K-Man out